Hi, I'm Arlene and I'm back again with another video. Today I'm going to be talking about three fragrances in my collection that have the note of saffron in it. So, I'm going to start off with Shagnoff Oud by Swiss Arabian. This is a beautiful Oudi rose sweet fragrance. It has praline in it. Um, I smell some type of fruit or berry, but that's not listed in the fragrance notes. But it's very pretty, long lasting. Um, the thing that I noticed about this one, when I first got it, it had a bit of that strong, like stinky type of oud that people talk about. So once you spray it, I would say spray it a good five to 10 times and then you'll get the real fragrance because I don't get that in the fragrance anymore. It's very sweet and pretty and long lasting. Um, to me, it smells a little bit like juicy fruit gum. That's what comes to mind with this fragrance. I really enjoy it. So the notes in Swiss Arabian, Shagnoff Oud, are saffron, argar wood, rose, argar wood again in the base, praline, and vanilla. Um, I don't know if I, if I stated that it's a bit spicy. So the saffron is what's making it a bit spicy. So these are sweet, slightly spicy, long-lasting fragrances that I'm talking about today. So the main accord in Shadnoff Oud are sweet, oud, vanilla, rose, warm, spicy, latonic, nutty, metallic, powdery, and floral. Very pretty fragrance. I have it on today. I have been enjoying my scent all day. It's, it stayed on with me from for hours because I put it on this afternoon before I left and it's well after 12 o'clock now. So that's Swiss Arabian, Shagnoff Oud. Very pretty scent. Ooh. Next... I have um, Mansara Instant Crush. This is a fragrance that I haven't given a full wear yet, but I have sprayed it and it lasted overnight, well into the day before I took another shower. Um, it's a spicy, warm vanilla. Um, I think it has some jasmine, some rose, ginger. So this one is a bit spicier with the ginger and um, the saffron mixed together. Let's see, what else do I, what I smell? It has, when you first smell it, it, it gives you a little bit of a burst of citrus or bergamot. And then that kind of dies down a bit. And then you start to get the sweetness and you get the spiciness also. It's a sophisticated scent. Scent. I think you can wear this um, any time of the day. I think it will shine better probably when it's cooler. And um, because it's long last, it's a heavy hitter. So yeah, it's a... Beautiful, spicy, vanilla type scent. So the notes are saffron, ginger, Sicilian, Sicilian, mandarin, Sicilian, bergamot. In the middle, you get amber wood, Moroccan rose, Egyptian, Egyptian jasmine, Indonesia patchouli leaf, Madagascar vanilla, white musk, sandalwood, oak moss. Yeah, I, I can't wait to wear this. This will soon be on my fragrance tray because I haven't had a chance to give it a full wear yet. 
The main accords are the main accords are warm, spicy, woody, amber, vanilla, powdery, citrus, musky, metallic, rose, and leather. I don't get the metallic or the leather, but I do enjoy the scent. I get that citrus and the sweetness. Yeah, very pretty. So that's Mansara Instant Crush. Next, with my saffron fragrance, is the new Ye Saint Laurent Lib Le Parfum. Um, this just came out a few weeks ago. This is a very pretty fragrance. You're getting that the spiciness from the saffron mixed with the orange and the vanilla and honey and with the lavender. Very pretty. Um, compliment getter. I've worn this already. Got compliments. It has honey in it. Um, so it's slightly sweet and smooth, a, a bit boozy, um, giving you like an ambery scent, like the color. Very nice. This is exactly the time of season for this one. I will be enjoying this. I already enjoyed it. <laughs> the notes on Ye Saint Laurent Lee, Lee Parfum are... Ginger, saffron, mandarin orange, and bergamot. In the mid, you have um, lavender, orange blossom, one of my favorite notes. In the base, you have bourbon vanilla, honey, taka bean, and vetiver. The vetiver is also adding to the spiciness, in my opinion. The main accords are vanilla, warm spicy, sweet citrus, aromatic, for sure, Honey, lavender, white floor, amber, and floral. So since I only had three saffron fragrances in my collection, I decided to show you what I would layer them with. Because that's what I do over here. I love to layer. So with the Shagnoff Oud, like I said before, it's a rose um, oud vanilla or praline type scent very sweet and pretty i like to layer it with mugler angel nova edt this one has lychee and bergamot with vanilla and um i think virginia cedar wood very pretty it's um it's like a creamy fruity scent very pretty only thing for me, it does not last, but when I layer it with the Shagnoff Oud, it brings out those imaginary fruit notes that I smell, and it makes it last longer, and it, I love it together. I really do. I have this on today. Very long. It's long-lasting. I can still smell it. Um, very pretty. So this will be my layering combo with Shag... Well, one of them for Shagnoff Oud. Then, with Mansara Instant Crush, I would layer it with Bath and Body Works, Wicked Vanilla Woods. This has notes of Magical Vanilla, Glowing Amberwood, Enchanted Pink Pepper. Since this is a spicy vanilla, slightly sweet, I can sweeten it up with the Vanilla Woods and also add a bit of more spiciness with the Pink Pepper and the amber wood that are all sweetened up, I think this will be a good combo. I haven't tried it, but you will hear about it because I'm sure it'll be on my fragrance tray very soon. Excited to wear the vanilla woods with Mansara Instant Crush. And next, the try and true, what everybody talks about on the internet, even though it's with the original Lieb and probably Lieb Intense, I'm going to go for it. Use Fairy Tale with Lieb, Lieb Parfum. 
It has the orange blossom, um, the vanilla, the honey, vetiver, the saffron. Got those spicy notes. And then we're going to sweeten it up and make it a bit more smooth, which is already smooth. Make it even more smooth and bring out the orange notes from fairy tale that has notes of pomegranate nectar, fresh orange blossom, vanilla bean, and warm amber. And also, I've already used this and I've used uh, orange, um, what is it? Citrus Mimosa Lotion, which is an orange, orange scented lotion. And while I'm sitting here thinking about it, I can also layer Lee, Lee Parfum with Orange Twist by Bath & Body Works. Because that's an orange, excuse me, that's an orange and vanilla fragrance to make it even sweeter and creamier if I want it. But I do think the fairy tale would be a good match. Because the orange notes and the creaminess is coming out in this too. So, there you have it. So, those are a few layering combos that I will use with my saffron fragrances. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, share, subscribe. Hello and welcome to all the new and existing subscribers. I finally hit that 400 mark. I thank you so much. Please keep sharing and leaving comments, hitting that like button, and um, watching the videos so we can get to 1,000 by December 31st. I hope you're enjoying all this content that I'm putting out all of a sudden in October for the, um, what is it called? Vlogtober. Um, yeah, so you, you'll be getting contact almost every day. I can't say every day, but almost every day for the rest of this month. So let me know if you enjoyed it. Let me know if you're going to try some of these combos. Let me know if you have any of these fragrances or what saffron fragrances that you like, that you're eager to wear in this cool weather because the fall is here. If you're in the Midwest, fall is here. Today, it was like mid to low 40s. It was cold. It is here. So let's talk about it in the comments and I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.